Hi everyone. So yesterday I actually found out that uh, I have the augmented reality option in Google Maps available. So I, was, I got very excited and I went out and I wanted to try. Now, as you can see, it's not so fancy, right? You have this uh, map which is kind of similar to what you use regularly at the bottom. Uh, so you can see the path and you have uh, the direction and those uh, labels and signs uh, available in augmented reality. Uh, so it's quite nice, but when I tried it, I actually felt that, uh, you know, uh, if I already know the direction uh, which I need to go uh, using just Google Maps, I can just, you know, take a glimpse and look at, uh, I found that I don't actually need this unless right. unless the navigation is kind of complicated for example if you need to enter like a, a certain street and sometimes it's not very clear where you're going uh it can it can be helpful but uh seeing this i actually wanted uh the path on the floor uh have some kind of a highlight so uh, this is something that i really wanted to have and as you can see all you have is those arrows and labels and signs that point you to the right direction. Now, if you use Google Map a lot like I do, uh, sometimes you want to have a very clear understanding where Turn to go. Left. So if you have like uh, uh, this type of uh, direction, it's not always very clear. You want to see it on the road itself, augmented on the road itself, something that shows you where you need to step. Uh, for example, if you need to enter a specific place in a building, uh, an entrance, uh, you know, this arrow won't be accurate, don't sh won't show you that. Uh, but I guess this is just, uh, you know, uh, we are, it's still early and we need the uh, AR Cloud in order to enable this kind of functionality to have a very clear uh, pathing when you get into buildings or even indoor navigation, of course, is all be available uh, using AR Cloud. So this is kind of uh, another layer of um, uh, navigation uh, on top of the standard navigation of Google Maps and it worked pretty well in general. Now, as you can see, th the thing is that you won't be holding the phone all, I mean, in front all the time because, of course, it's not safe and even Google tell you that you can see at the top for your safety, keep your phone down while you walk, of course. So when you think about it, this is good but for augmented reality glasses because if you're using with the phone you're just gonna put the phone up maybe for like a, a few seconds see the direction and continue Turn walking left. like you do in you know in in the start navigation uh, you can see i clearly know that i need to turn left the label says i need to go left you can see the arrows so it's clearly need to go left uh so it was very very clear that uh time but again overall i mean it's nice but if i'm excited about this no what would be great is the option to see maybe attractions and live notification. But again, we are going something beyond what Google Maps enables right now. But in the future, of course, we're going to have it. So I did use it for about half an hour or so, testing it, walking, and eventually I got to the right direction. And that's it. I was happy with it and I just closed it. Maybe I'm going to use it again, but overall, it's nice, but nothing to be excited about. Uh, so this is it for this video, uh, more coming, I just had a break because I needed to uh, start learning things related to augmented reality development, so this is why I was away, so sorry for that, so uh, more videos are coming, so stay tuned, and um, see you soon, bye bye.